Texas Motor Speedway. South Tunnel. Hey, hey look at you. Doing? Good, how are you? Good. You have prom this year? No, no, I graduated. I'm in college now. Is that good or bad? Good. I don't want to leave. Okay, good. <laughs> Thank you. Good morning. There's Kevin. Driving in Texas Motor Speedway. This is pretty cool. Texas Motor Speedway Media Center. It's just about 7.30. Sun's just coming up and look who I've got. Oh man! Here she is, ready to rock? Yeah. That's a very nice shirt, by the way. Yeah. See, we've got, we've got matching shirts, we got the metal. All right, we're off. Yeah, and where are we going now? We're going... Who wants? Exactly, C10 Nationals. <laughs> what do you think? Ready for some Ferris wheel action? Yeah. Yeah? I am too. The Mr. C10 Ferris wheel. The Texas Motor Speedway. It's not scary, it's just fun. <laughs> Why would it be scary? You're just going around in a circle. Yeah. Yeah. And you get to see all the trucks at the top. And you have oh, that's right. Oh, look at that. You can open the door for me. You're the best. First ride of the entire show. Oh, we get it. Ooh, we even get the seat belt. Excellent. Hey, and there's Mr. C10 right there. And Mrs. C10. Oh, that's not Mrs. C10. That's oh, that's Leona. Oh, that's it. Yeah. Yeah. Well, this is faster than last year. I know it is. And you know if this thing is here, there is trouble of ruling. It's not really built for going to a grocery store. I'm gonna pass it to you. You do run me. What's up guys? We're here at the C10 Nationals. We're lit, we're ready, we're at the AMD booth. Um, how did you, you're in the middle of conversation. AMD, auto metal direct. The camera shows up and Arnie goes, wait, camera. Hey, it's hey, Arnie. I'm exactly. like, hey, we're in the middle of doing exactly. business. He's all wound up. Hey, don't worry how we do business. All right? C10 Nationals, come and get a real ride along with Arnie in, 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 the, in the red OBS. And I'm gone. It's like a butterfly. <laughs> there you go. Right? This is his, uh, his office. Oh, I love the rear view mirror. Wow. Wow, that's a heck yeah. yeah. You can see out both sides. You don't even need your side mirrors. Yeah, all business. Yeah. And pleasure. Uh, TKX? Yes, TKX Carbon Edition from Brawler. Ooh. And LS37? It's an LS3. The LS3, okay. nice. 6 0. 6 0. Come on down.
not only we got the truck show here at the C10 Nationals, but you can get a ride along in a use. I want to call it Winston Cup. They're not Winston Cup anymore. Come on, that's cool. <laughs> full on, full on, 160 miles an hour. Curious car. You like that? You got a favorite one? Eminem. Eminem? Oh, Eminem's, of course. See, people say, I've got a decent job. You, my friend. Not so bad, right? Come try it sometime. So what? Come try it sometime. Oh, I've done, I yes, I love it. I will hopefully today again. <laughs> so fingers crossed. How long have you been doing this? Good morning, uh, Chris. About two weeks. No way. Uh, 20 years. 20 years. That's living the dream, my friend. Living the dream. And there's your there's your limo. Oh yeah. This is Wynn's limo. Those aren't real headlights, by the way. Are you sure? How can you tell they're not real headlights? Because it's a sticker. Oh, it's a okay. If you want the most wins, I recommend sitting towards the front. Towards the front for the most win? Yeah, because nobody's heads in your face. It's like barely any seats. The limo cup car. Texas Motor Speedway, C10 Nationals. That's right, Gannard Chevrolet Performance Parts. We're the Gannard Chevrolet Performance Parts Dyno. So if you're a registered participant here at the C10 Nationals, come on down, bring your truck, strap it down, and see what kind of numbers it's gonna put up. They give you a readout right up here on the screen. First diner run of the day, right? Yeah, first customer of the day. First customer of the day. And first customer. Who's, uh, whose truck is this? Everyone points this way. <laughs> That's the dude. Tell me about your truck. Uh, it's a five-speed uh, V6 V8 manual swap. Wait, what year is it? 03. 03. Yeah. Engine? 5.3, board 30 over. 5.3, board 30 over, three, three over with a uh, five-speed manual? Yes. Nice. Any other uh, modifications? We've got a truck noise BCR cam in it. There and you a go. Holly mid rise intake. Nice. Okay. Looks you got the square body syndicate. Yeah. And what have you had a dyno before? No, this is my first time. First time. Are you excited? Yep. Are you nervous? Uh, hopefully, I get it. You do the burnout contest uh, tomorrow? Hope so. Awesome. Awesome. Thanks for coming out, man. Let's see what this thing puts down. Dino Challenge. Are you? Uh, how do you feel about the numbers? Uh, I say it was running a little too smoky. But Did you see the number put down? Yeah, like two, two, two eleven. Yeah. yeah. Good, bad. I was surprised. I thought it was going to get three thirty. Really? But you're you're a little off. Yeah. That's all right. You're having fun, man. Thanks for coming out. Look at them all lined up, ready to rip. Right? That's it. Oh, look. That's it. You 
got his he got his partner in crime with her. Yeah, that's yeah. right. When is Wayne. here? You got any tacos? Wait, I think no, I heard you on the big si- on the big speaker system. Like that? Yeah, I did like that. Keep practicing. You see if we can get a ride along. Got my helmet. Racing birds autocross at the C10 Nationals. Look at this. Hater holes, Corvette wheels, whoa. And it's uh six six burn, burn, garage fire. Tell me the story. Uh, burned on January 5th. Uh, we put an air filter and a reservoir on it. Runs and drives. I love it. Thank you so much for coming out. Auto cry. And what's under the hood? Four. A big block Chevy. This is. This is awesome. 66 C10, 454 Corvette wheels, hater holes. That's what it's all about out here at the C10 Nationals, man. Look at that there, hard at work. And what year is this thing? 73. 73 LS7, right? Yes, sir. LS7 T56, three pedal car, six speed, not the TKX. Gonna do a little bit of uh, autocross action here at the C10 Nationals. Just like that, that's the lap. Good time, C10 Nationals. Thank you, sir. That thing, 72 K5 Blazer. And your dad bought it brand new? Bought it brand new. Bought it brand new. That is so awesome. My name's Jeff. Bill Pedigo. Bill, pleasure to meet you. Tell me about it, please. So it's a 1972 Blazer. It was bought on 11, 9 of 71, but it is a 72 model. My mom and dad bought it brand new. Um, we took it hunting. We took it all over the place, beat it up for years and years. Um, my dad passed away a few years back, and we decided to uh, redo the truck kind of in memory of him. Um, he was an ex Green Beret, so if you notice the color of it is a dark, dark green. It was oh. originally forest green. Um, I can't even tell. And it, uh, it has the original 350 engine in it, all original drivetrain, original tranny, actual case. So 350 small block, 350 small uh, block. turbo 350 transmission. No, that's a standard transmission. Oh, that's, sorry, 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 that's right. Muncie transmission and then a NP205 transfer case yes, yeah. with a 12 volt posi. 12 volt posi, Dana 44 in the front. Okay, yeah. uh, four wi- uh, front discs? Uh, yes. Rear, rear drums? Rear drums. Look at them. It is just gorgeous. Gorgeous. We did a slight lift on it. We put a, a four inch lift on it uh, just to kind of give it a better stance. I didn't go crazy with the tires because I wanted it to really kind of fit the wheel well so that yeah. it stayed kind of nice and stock looking. So. It's fantastic. Thanks so much for bringing it out. Thank you. Love Appreciate it. You. Little square body action, but not just your regular square body. Don't you? You're not getting away that easily. Pop that thing, please. Come on. You can't even hear it. I mean, it's a little. I use it like cliche. It's a cream puff, but yeah. Big block Chevy, 454 cubic inch power plant, turbo 400 behind it. It is. Look at. Tell me a little bit about it. Oh man, uh, been in the family since 1982. Awesome. Dad bought it. Uh, I remember dri- he drove all the way from East Texas to Dallas to get it. And 
got back home in the middle of the night and as a kid we couldn't wait to get up and run out there and see what he brought uh, carried a rural mail route in it sitting in the middle putting the mail in from the right hand side he he did a mail route in in a in a big block sitting in the middle look at the hubcaps Cheyenne Super all the trucks just sitting oh the interior has been redone though yeah okay done incorrectly in the 90s um, and then since I've got it back now and you know some of the materials and stuff are available and try to put it back to, to look more like it would have originally. How many miles on it? It's at least turned over 300. My brother says it's 400 so three to four hundred thousand miles. The motor's been rebuilt twice and I know the transmission at least one time. And That's so. My dad was an auto mechanic too so he carried the mail during the day and got home at 1 30 2 o'clock and we would work at the shop the rest of the day. That's and so that awesome. Business there, so. Thanks so much for bringing it out. Oh, thank you. Appreciate it. Big Block Chevy, C10 Nationals. And he's off. Oh, holy moly. horsepower and it's always a good time to see 10 nationals Gandrin Chevrolet performance dino challenge Day number two, C10 Nationals, Texas Motor Speedway. Oh, all right. I showed you this yesterday. Let's, uh... I'm gonna take you for a tour. TMS Media Center. I think it's kind of cool. The Wall of Fame. 
You got the defending champions from the different series. Willie. Oh, wait, wait for it. Wait. Oh, come on, number three. Kind of cool. Jeff, this set here reporting live from the C10 Nationals, Texas Motor Speedway. No Limit, Texas. Come on down. We are giving away a truck today, but you've got to be present to win. Pretty cool, right? A little behind the scenes action, Texas Motor Speedway. You having fun? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Getting ready for first lap. This is your first lap? Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Go get them. All right, let's show you some of these autocross trucks. What do you say? BFG giving rides, fast finches here, some of their rigs. Oh, TCI, Jason, one of the fastest trucks out here this weekend. And there he is, the man himself. What's more American than this? Texas Motor Speedway, the NASCARs ripping around the racetrack, trucks on the infield. This is just awesome. And you got the CPP truck over there. A lot of cross action for you. This would be a perfect, like, if you were sitting where I was sitting, you could go like that. But don't trust me with your Pretty good view at the C10 Nationals. up on the Mr. C10 Ferris wheel. Got my co-host here, Wynn. Hello. Hello. This is Fast Fitch on an old set of BFGs. Just a little push. How cool is that? The NASCAR limo in the background. Be sure to hashtag C10 Nationals on social media. This bitch, give it up for him. All
That's the truck we just gave away at the C10 Nationals Texas Motor Speedway. Pretty good stuff. I'm gonna get out there and try to get a couple laps out of TMS, what we call it out here, right? This car's probably gonna break Adios, down. Adios, amigos. Getting ready to head on the Texas Motor Speedway. this. The one try five in the midst of all these C10s. Look at them. Gonna get some laps. Texas Motor Speedway. All right. The family that drives the track together stays together. You guys are crammed in there like sardines. Go Bucks Wild Dallas. We're comfortable. With the dually, what's under the hood? Simply the LS motor. Come on, not a big block? Not a big block. 4 L80 trans and nice. 4 in the rear end. Very nice. Thanks for coming out, man. Thank you.
If that doesn't put a smile on your face, I don't know what will. Come on! Had a girl. Had a girl. <laughs> Turn four, Texas Motor Speedway, come on, yeah. Thank you. Texas.